Dungeon Quest Deluxe Edition. And welcome to Turn 4. And I can't believe I did this. First of all, I hope everyone's doing good. I hope you're enjoying this. I'm glad you're here for the holiday season. Um, enjoying some Christmas, you know, adornment with Frosty over there and Snowy. I can't believe I did this. And you guys, have you ever tried to do a playthrough running four heroes in a game? You know what we forgot to do? Eldoran. He was over here because I said I was going to send him into the catacombs, and I forgot to take his turn. I am so sorry about that because we went to Ulav, and then, remember, he got the crypt, I believe, right? And then um, we went to him. So right now, real quick, we're going to kind of go back to turn three, and I'm not going to take him into the catacombs. Uh, should I? No, we'll wait. I'm going to keep going, okay? So we're going to move him. This is turn three, okay? Because we've got Mystic Orbital. Let's do this quick. So we're on turn three for him, and I please forgive me for that. Okay, so we find this corridor. So he, he heads south, and there's an exit to the east. I must draw a card. I'm going to split the deck. I, feel, I felt like redoing the whole thing, but I'm like, no, I'll just explain it. It was an accident. And it's empty, so not a big deal. We're going to set that over here. Now, now is turn four. Should have went into the catacombs, but I'm sure we're going to get to it. Okay, so remember, now we're officially in turn four. Sorry. Valric went and encountered two rotating rooms, which is kind of weird, because there's not that many of those. Of course, we're going to have to move north. Facing towards us. And we're going to go into the Mystic Orbotile. And we get... We get, okay, that's just a, it's a cool tile, isn't it? So he walks into a room, it's got a wooden floor. It looks like there's like, I bet that looks kind of cool, doesn't it? Looks like there's a monster in there. We have an exit to the north and to the east. And of course, we're going to draw a room card. You just saw me cut that. So, and it is, oh, a champion of chaos. We're going to see combat now and how I handle combat. Toughest monster in the game. That is like at the top of the hierarchy. So this is kind of fun. I love this little combat system. It's not too complex. It's just it's charming is what it is. So we're being faced with the champion of chaos here. And we have to decide. Do we want to flee from him? Do we want to attack? Or do we want to wait and see? Well, I'm not going to wait and see. Those are the three options we could choose. And then we draw these cards to see. So let's just randomly grab one here. Let's grab this one. Okay, and I'm going to attack him. So what we do is we flip this over. We're going to attack. And he has got four life points. Do you see that there? Okay, so he has four life points. We're going to come over here to this. One, two, three, four. That's his health marker. And we're going to get his cards. Now let me tell you how I... I wanted to actually do a, like a little mat for doing this. Mighty Blow. Slash. Leap Aside. This will make sense when you see what I'm, I'm, how, I, how I solo this. We're going to assign Mighty Blow, 1, 2, Slash, 3, 4, Leap Aside, 5, 6. I have the same things down here. Okay? So what you do is, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to say my first attack is going to be Mighty Blow. That's my first one. Remember those numbers I just said? This is whatever comes up, that's what he's going to do. 5. He does Leap Aside. So what we do is, I did Mighty Blow, he did Leap Aside, we're going to come over here to the chart. Okay, so see, Adventure, Mighty Blow, he did Leap Aside. See how that works? It's kind of like that. I took a hit. So we're going to minus one, and then we do that again. It's kind of cool, huh? Um, I'm going to do Mighty Blow again. That's going to be my move, and we'll see what he does. Four. He does Slash. Let's consult the chart. Mighty Blow, Slash. See that? We did two damage. I think you'll get acclimated once we do that, but he took two damage for that. Okay, another round of combat. Um, I'm gonna do <clears throat> leap aside, or I'm sorry, slash. We'll see what he does. Mighty blow. I think this would be bad. So I did slash. He did mighty blow. See that? I took one damage for that. So I took one. Okay, now if we can do another, if we can get another mighty blow on him, we can kill him if he if he chooses the right one. 
one mighty blow against mighty blow. I believe we're both going to take a damage. See how that works? Okay, he's going to take one. I'm going to take one. And we do another round of combat. You know, this is simple, but I, I don't know, I find it charming. And I'll tell you what, we're going to try to finish him off with a slash. Let's see. Four. Slash. And slash, I think we're both going to take one. And then that's it. We have killed the champion of chaos. I hope you like that. So I hope you saw how that worked there. You know, one, two, three, four, five, six. We roll. That's what he chooses. And that's how I roll doing combat. So we're going to take him, set him aside. That is done. So there we go. You saw some combat for the first time in the game. And Valric is down to 11 life points. Okay. And you know what? I forgot that. We had to move the Sun Tracker up. Remember? Because he's the first one. Okay, i got to get back on track now. So next up we have Ulav. And Ulav is here. We can go east or west. We're definitely going to go east. Mystic Orb of Tile. And we get... That's a nice room. But see, now that's... This is going to be a problem chamber. Because if you notice, it will do that. There's only... We have to search for a secret room because, see, that's hindering us from getting over here. So what we're going to do is, of course, we've got to do a room um, card, but we're going to search. And searching can be really bad. Okay, so we're going to draw a room card, and it's empty. Let's put that over here. And we will not forget this time about um, Eldoran. And so we're going to move him, of course, east. Go into the Mystic Orbo Tile. And we get, okay, is that like a cart? Got a pickaxe there. Got that kind of room. Guys, there's all kinds of rooms here. There's traps and spider webs and all kinds of stuff. So we're going to have to come over here and draw a room card. And it is a mountain troll. Look at this. This is a round for combat. Okay, so we got to shuffle these up as best as I can here. Okay, I'm going to set this down here. And. under that that was a dumb thing to do mountain troll see because I chose wait and see he's got five life points oh wow so remember how we did this one two three four five six let's give him let's put up his health meter to five this is gonna be tough and I'm gonna open up with mighty blow let's grab that and let's start one slash against mighty blow um see mighty blow slash he took two damage already so one two he's down we got him down to three life points um i'm gonna try slash for my next attack four leap aside so he leaped aside when i did the slash so slash against leap aside see how that works he took another damage we got him down to two. Man, Eldoran is whooping the heck out of the mountain troll. And I'll tell you what, how about for the final one, the killing blow, because we can land two hits if Mighty Blow hits. So let's see. Three. So that would be Leap Aside. I don't think that's good. So we did Mighty Blow, he did Leap Aside, and that's we would take a damage. So Eldoran takes one damage. And... I'm going to push that again. We're going to do Mighty Blow. Four. Gosh darn it. Did the same thing. So the Mountain Troll does Leap Aside. Mighty Blow, Leap Aside. I take another damage. So I've got two life points left. Um, I'm going to do it again. Let's do this. Come on. That's it. I'm not doing it again. Same outcome. Mighty Blow, Leap Aside, I take another damage. And we're going to change it up. Now watch, as soon as I choose something else, he's going to do something else. Slash. No. Leap Aside, Slash. 
So slash, leap aside, he takes one. You got him down to one hit point. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna do leap aside. Leap aside, leap aside. I think we're both gonna take one. Leap aside, yes, right here. We both take one, but we killed him. He got him down to seven life points though. Wasn't good. Okay, so that is done. You know what I did? I used Ulav's instead of Eldron. I, am, I apologize. I should have used his little plaques. Okay, we're going to take this. Remember, we're putting it over here. So, you see what I mean? I used his plaques instead of his. But, same outcome. It has the same stuff. And then finally, our last guy for this turn is Sir Rohan. And he is here, and he can move. We're going to move him west. Mystic Orbotile. And we get a, another empty one. We're, get, we're running out of these. Trust me, there's some bad stuff coming up. And wait till you see the bottomless pit. That. I can, that's instant death. Okay, so remember, we're going to arrow from where we're entering. So we can go north or south. And draw the room card. It, a death warrior. This, um, this is a lot of combat this round. Okay, so we're going to do this again. Shuffle these. We're just going to take the top one. So you see it shuffled. Now we have to say what we're going to do. I'm going to say wait and see. Let's wait and see what this Death Warrior does, okay? Wait and see, Death Warrior. These monsters are tough tonight. Okay, he's got five life points. Let's move this back up. And we'll get, make sure we get Sir Rohan's plaques. They're all the same, though, but just, you know, the art, of course, is different. And remember how we did this. One, two, three, four, five, six. And I'm going to open up with, I always open up with Mighty Blow. So let's see what he does. Five. He does slash. I do Mighty Blow. Mighty Blow, slash, boom. Two hit points down. So this Death Warrior has three life points left. What do you think? Should we try um, Mighty Blow again? Let's do it. And if this works, we're going to end with a slash. Three. I think we're going to take a hit. So I did Mighty Blow. He did Leap Aside. And I'm going to take a hit. So Ro Sir Rohan, he's got a lot of life points, though. So that happens there. Um, I'm going to push Mighty Blow again. And he, look at that, fell for it. Slash, Mighty Blow, of course. Mighty Blow, Slash, he's going to take two. And then finally, let's do this. I'm going to do Slash. Here we go. Slash and Slash, I believe we're both going to take a hit for that. Slash and Slash, yes, right there. We killed him. And, but we do take a hit for that. And wow, that was quite a round of combat. Put that over here in our discards. And that was a big round, guys. That was like, what, three of the four heroes all were engaged in combat. I hope you're enjoying this. This is a very exciting game. Um, and hopefully, maybe, what, you're going to put this on your Christmas list. Um, this is a hard one to find, though, to be honest. Uh, 1987, especially Catacombs, the expansion. Okay, guys, I'm going to upload this. We're going into turn five. We didn't, we're not going to mess up again. We did everything right, pretty much. Okay. I'll be back. I'll see you in a bit.